In a case to prevent recalled CCC lawmakers from running in by-elections, the High Court has reserved its decision. Judge Justice Never Cotillo, presiding over the High Court, has deferred ruling on a case filed by Sanjizo Chibangu. The self-declared acting Secretary General of the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC. Chibangu is attempting to keep lawmakers who have been recalled from taking part in the Saturday by-elections. Shibanga claimed that 14 lawmakers and 17 council members connected to the CCC were no longer party members and used his self-imposed power to recall them, to challenge the by-elections. The recalled lawmakers did, however, successfully file their nomination papers. Shibanga wants to prevent these recalled lawmakers from taking part in the elections in their capacity as the CCC's leaders. Nelson Chamisa and Company Nonetheless, Shibangu has been rejected by Chamisa's CCC, which views him as a ZANU PF imposter. Justice Cotillo questioned the rationale for Chibangu's designation as an imposter during the court proceedings. Agency Gumbo, a legislator for the Hatcliffe CCC who was co-joined in the lawsuit, contended that Shibangu had turned into a phony by recalling lawmakers from a different party. Gumbo drew attention to the fact that Chibangu ran his own party in the 2023 harmonized elections, endorsing candidates who were subsequently defeated by Chamisa-backed legitimate CCC candidates. Gumbo questioned Chibangu's choice to recall opposition candidates following the defeat of his own. Louis Uriri, Chibangu's attorney, urged the court to approve his client's application on the grounds that the recalled lawmakers had been expelled and ought not to be permitted to speak on behalf of the CCC. Shibanga was the acting secretary general of the only acknowledged CCC party, Uriri underlined. Alec Muchidahama, the attorney for the recalled lawmakers, countered that Shibanga's application was improperly submitted in the incorrect court and therefore to be rejected. Muchidahama said that if the recalled candidates had not been legitimate members of the CCC, the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission ZC would not have accepted their nomination papers. Moreover, he pleaded with Justice Cotillo to reject the application, emphasizing that the votes were already printed. ZC's attorney, Tawanda Kanangoni, gave the court her word that they will abide by the ruling in the case. The outcome of this lawsuit by the High Court will have a big impact on the next by-elections. It is unclear if Chibanga's application will be successful in preventing the recalled lawmakers from running for office or if they will be permitted to run as candidates on behalf of the CCC. All sides involved are eagerly awaiting the ruling, which will provide clarification on the situation and could influence the nation's political climate going forward.